Well, it's time for tonight's Tool Time Award, and it goes to the FBI. Lately, seems like the FBI has been spending more time creating terrorists than actually catching the real ones. See, the Bureau's latest attempt to create and foil a terror plot in Southern California backfired, to put it mildly. The FBI, in their never-ending quest to foment violent jihad within the United States, sent an ex-convict named Craig Monti to a mosque in Irvine, California, to find and recruit possible terrorists. But apparently, Craig here came on a little bit too strong to the non-jihadist members of the mosque because they ended up reporting him to the FBI due to his talk of violent jihad. They even got a restraining order against him. Now, it turns out that Craig is a bit of a character himself. He, like many FBI informants, has spent a little time in jail. And he made a pretty penny while working for the U.S. government. He made 177000 tax-free dollars in his 15 months of service. So in return, Craig helped build a terrorism case against one of the mosque's members, which was so flimsy that the Justice Department took the very rare step of dropping the case. After, of course, the man in question had already been portrayed as being a dangerous terrorist who was a threat to national security. So now, Monte is going public with the inner workings of the FBI, claiming that he was trained by the FBI to entrap Muslims. Now, this is probably not the best news for them, especially since many people, including myself, had some very serious questions about the alleged Christmas tree bomber, who, quote, acted alone, except for the fact that he was given a fake car bomb by the FBI. So perhaps it's time that the feds start vetting their informants a little bit better. They start realizing that spending time and resources creating terrorists rather than fighting actual terrorists probably isn't the best way to keep America safe. I've got news for you, FBI. Not every Muslim living in America is a jihadist. And the fact that your informants are scaring ordinary individuals and then getting reported back to you, well, that's just embarrassing. And that's why the FBI is tonight's Tool Time winner.